So today is the hardest set of games we're going to have to play this season. Five games against the likes of AC Milan, Juventus, Napoli, Fiorentina and Inter Milan. And you know, you know that's, it's just too easy. So what I've done is managed to injure all my best players. <laughs> Great! <laughs> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to Club 4, Episode 4 of The Journeyman. And as I said in the intro, we've got quite a few injuries. Um, you know, it's not been good. But first, let's check at the check at the schedule. Check at the schedule. Yeah, that makes sense. Right, so after the 3-1 defeat against AC Milan, we drew with Atalanta, 2 all, and it was all going well. Belletti scored a goal, the big target man. I'll show you him in a minute. He looks like a quality young prospect. Evandro with a goal, all good, all good in the world. And then Thomas party, it ain't no party like a Thomas party, and he obviously had to be somewhere for a party, I imagine, because he got himself sent off in the 59th minute. And then Mitrovic, the new ex-Newcastle player, is he? That That is him, yes. Um, banged himself two goals, one in the 89th minute, and they drew to all. So then we changed tactic, and I'll show you that in a minute. And we beat uh, Perskara 1-0, Jerry getting the only goal. Then we beat Trap Trapani 1-0, and Belletti getting the goal for us. So we've gone proper Italian football. 1-0 wins all the way. This is the future, or, or past, really. Um, so today, we're playing AC Milan and Juventus. Easy, right? We're 3-1 we're down after the first leg. We've got a lot to do, and... Um, these are our injuries. So Immobile's out for a week or two. So is Belletti. So is Party. There's no long-term injuries, but they're all going to be out for like the two most important games of the season so far. So let's get rid of them. That'll be fun. Right. And uh, Jerry's going to play. Go on, Jerry. Go on, Jerry. And, um... Oh, that's just... Bit... It's shit for shit, isn't it, really? Uh, Santa Mina is going to also play up top. And then Chris Colo is going to play in the central midfield positions. Um, if we look on the tactics, you'll probably recognise this. It's the tactic we used um, in the Liverpool beta. We've used it on and off over different saves and stuff when we needed something different to do. Uh, Santa Mina is not going to play there. We'll play him as a deep line forward. Um, Jerry as a Poacher, I think, is his preferred move, so we'll go with that. So it's a sort of pretty standard tactic, really. Normally it's quite controlling, but we've actually adapted it slightly. Because of this run of games, where we play AC Milan, Juventus, Napoli, Fiorentina and Inter Milan, fun times, um, I thought we'd change it up to sort of try and get a bit more counter-attacking. Now, let you in a little spoiler. I've recorded this bit before. So I did all my little bit at the beginning, like I've just done, and then we start, kicked off the game, yeah? Four minutes in, we scored a goal! I'm like, yes, big celebration. Looked over at my other monitor where I've got my recording software. I'd left the giant picture of my house up, so you couldn't see anything for the whole of the episode so far. So I obviously just quit instantly and reloaded the game, and then we carry on. So we were 1-0 up, so obviously we're going to lose 4-0 now, and that's just the way of the world. Um, right. What are we going to do? Yeah, I want to show you this guy. Um, one of the injured guys. Where is he? Gino Belletti, 19-year-old Italian, three-star, five-star potential, only worth a million. But I think this guy could be a very good player. He's quite an all-round player. He's actually a decent finisher and decent heading and jumping reach as well. So I quite like this guy. I think he could have a big future. So we're going to try and give him lots of games. Um, He's only scored three this season, six assists. Uh, most of this before we arrived, obviously. But um, he's scored a couple for us since, we, since we've come in. So I think this could be a, a sort of superstar of the team. I think he's basically Immobile's replacement, really. Because um, I think we're going to get rid of him. 60 grand a week. We need to cut down the wages drastically uh, next season. Quick look at the finances. This, this is a fun story. So 2.3 million in debt. And you're thinking, okay, yeah, we knew that. Well, no, no, that's not the case. So what I did, somebody in the comments suggested that I sell all the, the clauses, like, um, you know, 30% sell-on fee, or they're going to pay me after a certain amount of games, and you can sell those. Um, so I managed to sell them for about two and a half million, which drew us zero balance. And then I hit continue a couple of times on the game, and now we're back to 2.3 million in debt. It's so much money, it's ridiculous. We've got to do wonders this summer. We've got to sell... All these players, pretty much, apart from about four, I think I'm keeping. 
Everybody else is out, right? Everybody is out. There's so much wages sitting here. Somebody worked it out. It's like 180 grand or something like that a week just sitting here. So, right, we're going to get rid of all that crap in the summer. I'm so looking forward to the summer. Once we're out of... No, sorry. Once we've won the cup, um, we're going... I'll sort of zip through the season a little bit quicker. The league table's looking all right. We're ninth in the league, a point above where we need to be. So we're four points clear of dropping to 11th, which is good. Bit of, bit of gap there. 38 games in the season, so we've got 10 games left. Right, let's just, let's just get into this. Let's just get into it. Right, so we need to win 2-0. Two 2-0. Nil, two nil. Away goals don't count, I've been told. Better be true, because I'll give someone a slap if it's not. Um, so hopefully, they are massive favourites, as you'd expect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. A lot of things have been said about this team, and not all of them fair. Make sure the players prove a point. Okay, yep, Stam's been taking his angry pills. Good to see. Right, that didn't work at all. Yeah, okay. Let me take over. Yep, I'll get some green. Right, let's go. Let's do this. Come on, please. Please, just give us a little hope. Just don't concede too early. <laughs> we scored, right? We were one up. We should score again. It's only fair that we go one up again. It's only for my own stupidity of actually not showing the game that we're doing this again. Right, here we go, boys. I'm, I'm worried about our attack, really. Jerry's all right, but ev everybody else is shit apart from the guys that are injured. So, not looking forward to that. Let's see how our counter-attacking tactic plays off. So, 58% possession because, of course... Oh, no, no. Forget that then. 52. Right. This is about as exciting as Italian football. Okay. Good first half, everyone. <laughs> That'd be great. Apart from the fact we need to win 2-0. Right, tactics. Um, we've got to go for it, haven't we? We've got to go for it. See, we're going to lull them, you see. Um, they're thinking we're just sort of playing playing for time, trying to get a nil-nil. No, mate, we're coming out firing second half. Here we go. Come on, boys, little team talk. What are we going for? Assertive push forward. I'm trying to get an early goal in the second half. It'll rattle them. Just want to say a massive thank you to Tom Lazinski for becoming a Patreon or patron on Patreon. Thank you very much, mate. Your support is hugely appreciated. If anyone who wants to check out our Patreon, um, go on, go on, Jerry. Yes, Jerry. Come on, Jezza. Get in there. Peruzzi with a great assist. Jerry with a header. It's 1-0. The dream is alive. Lovely ball in from deep. Couldn't beat his man, so it just didn't bother. Keepers had a keepers had a mare there. It's fair to say keepers had a mare. So if you if you even if you have no intention of donating on Patreon, I would advise you to go and click on the link in the description and just go and have a look. There's a video on there just sort of outlining my plans for the sort of channel and the community, just so you can learn a bit more about it. Even if you don't have any intentions of donating and stuff, um, it's just quite interesting, I think. So go check it out. Right. 30 minutes gone. Can we do some magic here? This has not been the most exciting games. They've made a substitute. Good for them. They're rattled. What are we going to do? 20 minutes left. We're going to have to do something different here. Team 19, you need to go four at the back. Interesting throw. They're kind of time-wasting with half 20 minutes left. All right, here we go. Building from the back. This is the magic. Or, or just hoof it forward as well. Yeah, that works as well. Okay. Cock blocker. To Maori. To Lopez. A space on this right, cock blocker, ball in, silver. If they score, we're kind of sh screwed. Oh, look at the space! There's three centre backs. Oh my word! That's awful, mate. That is awful. Is that a let off? Is that our little moment? Right, we're gonna give it another th few minutes, and then we're gonna go all out. Balls to the wall, attack. Right, that's it. Right, it's time. Right, let's bring on another useless striker. Hooray! Um, and B can come out off because he's just old. There's no other reason. He's just really old. Right, Jerry, you're poacher, right? You you go poach. Evandro. Um, uh, we could do trick or tease. Drop into the hole. I wouldn't mind that. Just a bit more support. 
Mina can stay as the deep line forward. The rest of you can stay there. We've got to push this line up. Or oh, I need to sort of sort out. <laughs> Leave a big fucking gap in central defence. Going to push it right up. Um, forget the look for the overlap. Go a little bit more direct. Maybe sent. This is dangerous. This is this is very dangerous. We got to go for it. There's no point. There's no point getting a little one nil victory. It don't matter, does it? Right, come on, boys. Ten minutes left. Just create a good chance. Nothing happens. They just hate that. Because at the very least, you expect them to have an attack because you've got so few defenders or something happens, but nothing happens at all. It's a victory. It's a pretty good victory. I'm happy with the victory. That first leg just... It was like a punch in the cock, wasn't it? That first leg, basically. Well done, boys. Did really good. Good for the morale, though, because that's a good victory again. away to AC Milan. That's fine. Uh, half a million quid. Cool. That, that'll last us an afternoon. That's good. Right, on to the next game against Juventus. Fun times. Right, here we go. Second game. First time we've played Juventus. They're currently second in the league. Are they still... I don't know if they're still challenging for the title or if Inter Milan have pulled away. Let's have a look eventually when, when the game decides to load. Right, um, let's have a look. Seven points. If they lose this, it's as good as dead, really, isn't it? I can't see Inter losing that many more games this season. Apart from, obviously, when they play us. But um, other than that, Juventus need this one. Okay. I, w I was just thinking, as it was loading, that we need to... Like, I don't care where we come this season, as long as we keep our job, right? So I'm thinking of doing, like, the minimum amount required to keep our job. And... Ooh, oh! This is a really brilliant one. Look at this. We've just been paid 400 grand by Venlo. Because when we bought Havoc for Venlo, we bought them from Lazio. I didn't even realise. So they've just paid us 400 grand. Thank you very much. We really needed that. Let's have a quick look at Venlo while we're here. I think they're still doing really well. I think they're going to come second in the league. They're eight points off top and they've played a game more. But they've got a good chance of Champions League this year. So fair play to the new manager after selling all my players. Obviously, that was needed. Um, but I'm thinking of, like, let's have a look here. There's, there's a couple of players like Evandro. Somebody like Evandro, I want to sell in the summer. Okay, he's worth quite a bit of money. So I'm thinking of just playing him, even though he might not be the best option. Um, I'm thinking of just playing him. Same as Santi Mina. Both these players, I think we can replace cheaper and better if we can sell these for 15 million. So I'm actually just going to play them. Um, it might not be the best. Oh, we've got no left back. Okay, who wants hands up? Who wants to play left back? Any, any, oh, okay, he's two-footed, can't tackle or cross. Okay, good. Um, what about you? Yes, he's right-footed, but we could, he could do a bit of a Milner, couldn't he, on that? Yeah, let's go for Marin. Sorry, Marin. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Um, oh, hang on, what about you? Catalan or left? Oh, yes, we'll go for you. You look like you could actually do a half-decent job there, so. Sorry, Marin. In and out. Okay, right. Anybody else that we want to sell at the end of the season that we just want to keep playing to, to keep their value high? Not really. They're the two big main ones that we've got, already got in, though. I can't see them scoring many goals. How many goals have they got between them? Six goals in 40-odd games. Amazing. Right. Swap them. Does that do any good? Okay, Mina can play Poacher. And I prefer advance forward overall as a, as a thing. Um, yeah, good. Vandro, deep line playmaker. Good. Right, Juventus. Good luck, everyone. Score predictions. Um, I'm going to go for, where is it? Away. 3-0 um, Juventus, I think. Uh, it'll be a tight game, but I think Lazio will lose this one. Okay, tight game. Take a tight game. Our key man is Pazella, the uh, centre-back. I'm actually learning the names now, which is good. Both teams coming to this in good form. <laughs> yeah. It's not the best weather out there. Don't care. Yeah, whatever. They didn't even... Okay, they've got Brady. They've got Isco. Okay. Kurt Zuma. Ooh, how much did they buy him for? 22 million. Not a bad little pickup, that. I would have taken that. Right, here we go. A lot of... <laughs> Yapstam's... 
just a broken record. A lot of things have been said about this team. Not all of them fair. Okay, we'll go with it again. That That's worked better that time. I don't know what people are saying about us, Yap. I think you're getting a bit paranoid. Are you wearing your tin tinfoil hat, are you? Bless him. Right, here we go. It's pissing down. That might help slow the game down a bit. Take a draw. All day long. Let's see how we go. This would be interesting to see how far away or close we are to Juventus as a team. That's not the best header, is it, though, for Seti? Let's go. Space on this left. Don't score 20 seconds in, though. That's rude. Oh, look at this space. Oh, there's the space. Yes. Okay, this is... I think... I feel like this is a proper highlight, not a little kickoff highlight, is it? It's going on far too long. Game. Go away, game. Lirola. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. Just... Just... Um, some of you spotted it last episode, but all I'll say is keep an eye on the billboards. Just saying. All right? Just saying. All right. 20 minutes gone. We've had a shot. Good to see. I didn't think we'd have more possession. It's kind of weird. All right, here we go. Goal time. Vassetti to Castellano. Filling in at left back. Decent pass in. Lovely stuff. Chris Colo. Evandro. Cheeky back heel. Cavallari. What in the holy fuck is that? What was that? That is horrific. <laughs> right. It's not the boards that rotate, but it's it's the static boards you need to look out for. They've got they've got lots of rotating boards, so none of them are, none of them are what I want them to be. Okay, okay, we're having some shots. These were previous ones I actually downloaded as a pack. Just because it's what, to fun to advertise some random FM websites. Um, but the static uh, billboards you need to look out for. Okay, I can't believe we missed that chance. And we're going to get punished for it. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, how did you miss that chance? I would have scored that. Ish. Right, plays it out to this right hand side. Dinks it across, takes a touch, tight angle. Goalkeeper's in all the wrong position because goalkeepers in FM don't know how to defend their near post. <sighs> it's a pretty even game, though. I'm not going to change anything up at the moment. We don't need to change anything, boys. Just carry on. Okay. Kalinic hoofs it out. Santi Mina tries to win the header. Doesn't. Go on, get a tackle and get your foot in, son. Or just watch him. Just run alongside. Hold hands if you like. Isco. Danger man. Decent ball in. Berardi misses the header. We clear it away, but it's just going to come straight back. Alexandro. Oh, come on, man. Oh, there's a bit too much space here. There's way too much space for Super Mario. Yes, Peruzzi. Key man. Right, Evandro. Can he find the pass? Is he just going to run all day and shoot horribly wide? We've got men forward here. It looked like a dive. Oh my word, what what an attack that was. Devastating, lads, devastating. We had a dive and a, just giving it away. Oh, we've given it away again. Oh my god. It's like a bloody carry on film, this team. Oh, I'm so looking for, I'm so want the summer. I'm going to destroy this team. <laughs> I'm going to tear it apart. There's like four players that... Obviously, I'd probably have to keep a lot of players, but there's if I could, I think there's about four players I'd keep. The rest can fuck off. I just don't think we'd have any money to replace anyone. That would be the slight problem. Like, we've not been good enough. Let's go aggressive. It wasn't... No, it wasn't horrific. I'm not going to go mad. Just sound lucky, boys. We created chances. We just can't score any of them. Well, let's go Oradjo. He's also on the transfer list. He's on a massive wage. Nobody wanted him, even for free. Shop window, lads. Shop window. You don't. You all don't know this yet, but this is shop window because you will be culled. Right. They're going to call this the Lazio cull. It's it's going to be that big. There's going to be body parts. Oh, Radio's injured. That's amazing. Well done, mate. You played great for that four minutes that you're on. Okay, um, let's bring Jerry on then. 
At least he's got a chance of actually scoring us a goal, Jerry. We've played all right, man. We've played all right. It's not a 2 0 game. Not a 2 0 game at all. And we beat AC Milan last time out, so, you know, it's not all bad. Obviously, apart from the results, they've been all bad. And they're quite important as well, I suppose. So, yeah. Okay, here we go, boys. Lovely ball through. Evandro. He's not going to score. It's Evandro. Yes! Wasn't expecting it. I double bluffed him. Reverse psychology. Well done, Evandro. That's that's a million pounds worth of transfer, isn't it? Goal against Juventus. Takes a couple of decent touches there, to be fair. And then just dinks it into the top corner. Lovely finish, mate. Lovely. I take it all back. You're a legend. Still not keeping you. You can fuck off, but... Right. Oh, oh, a corner. Juventus. Are, are they struggling? Right, Peruzzi. He's got all the time in the world. What sort of magic can he do? Oh, we're going to lose this, aren't we? Chris Colo, don't lose it. Hit one. Oh, that's decent. That is decent. Little tester. Um... Boo, boo, boo. Okay, Vipes can come on for Mbiwa. Right, Nonny. That is a good name for a goalkeeper. I like that. Right. Attack, 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 attack. Get creative. I don't know why I've gone Scottish. Right, 15 minutes left. Come on, boys. Can't believe we're giving them such a game, to be fair. Another yellow card. It's all good. Don't worry about it, lads. Can we nick an equaliser? Probably a deserved equaliser, I'd say. Come on. Come on. No. I hate watching the time just run out and there's no highlights. Uh, well, <laughs> trying to have to take the positives. We weren't embarrassed. <coughs> we weren't embarrassed. We held our own. Easily held our own. Well done, boys. I'll say it's... I'll, I'm not going to get angry at him. Yeah, tough result to take. Well done, Yapstam. He's actually said something different. That's fine. That that That's all good. What are they going to... Okay, how long is it? Seven weeks. Amazing. Amazing. Hey. <sighs> See? Tight contest. Right. Here, oh, who, who are they looking at? Um, oh, he's our loanee. This guy looks really good as well, but he's only on loan. I don't think Inter are going to sell him, to be honest. But I'll try, because he's a very good player. Right, let's have a look at the schedule. I think we might shoot to the end of the season now. Because we, we're not going to... Unless... What I'll do... So, the next episode will be the final two games of the season. Udinese and Torino. Um, Joe Art's team. Um, but what I'll do is, if there's anything weird or wonderful happening, like there's a chance of Europe, or there's a chance of getting sacked, or whatever it is, if there's something interesting in between, we'll come back and do that. Um, but if not, I think we just need to get to the end of the season now. See how much debt we've got. Okay, so here's the question of the day for you guys in the comments. Currently, we have minus 1.4 million in the bank. Okay, how much debt will we have, right, when we kick off this game against Udinese on the 12th of May, which is basically two months' time, how much debt will we have? I'm going to say... 12 million. I'm going for 12 million. I'm going to write it down. 12 million. Please put in the comments what you reckon the debt will be. 12 million. Okay, that's me. Right. <laughs> yeah, so put in the comments how much debt we're going to play the debt game. Debt game. Just off the cuff, that was amazing. Right, thank you very much for joining me, guys. Please hit that like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you bright and early for the next episode. Bye bye.